So hi guys and welcome back. Today we will take a look at the latest version of the Demon Core PDP. So this is, as you can see, a, a PDP, a power distribution board. Uh, it offers 5 volt or 12 volt for all of your uh, FPV stuff. So as you can see here, for your camera, for your video transmitter and of course for your OSD. It is meant to be used for 3 to 5S, so for 3 to 5 cells, but can support of course more as long as you uh, do not exceed the maximum amperage of it. The maximum amperage which it can receive is 80 amps or 120 amps in burst so this is really nice and uh, depending on how many cells you use you will have to take care to not draw too much amperage from the specific 5 volts and 12 volts uh, 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 points of it so this is important so how does this work so maybe some of you well, well most of you will know this but i will tell it anyways so here on the bottom you will just connect your flight battery you can hear it is nicely labeled with plus and minus. So that comes here. And then you have these really nice and large solder pads here. So I really like this, where you can actually connect your ESCs, which then goes to your motors. So this is the power distribution part of this board. But it is also, of course, a, a down stepper so it will provide 5 volts or 12 volts for your camera OSD and video transmitter and you can see that here on this part here so here you can see you have the cam and there you have signal plus and minus so signal is of course the video signal plus and minus is to supply the voltage to the camera the same for the video transmitter, signal, plus and minus, and basically the same for the OSD, so it's a bit different here. You have here plus, you can see it better on this side, so here on the outer side is plus. So you have here uh, plus, minus, and actually the signal connected then to your video transmitter. And if you don't use an OSD, you can actually just connect the, the, these two pads with each other and you won't need to use an OSD. It has another great feature, which is it will let you decide what uh, voltage your camera, video transmitter and OSD need. This is done with these pads on top here. Let me just get a pen to better show you. So here on top you can see. Uh, that's yeah, now you can see it really nice. Here on top, you see for the cam, you have 12 volts or 5 volts and this middle pad. And if you, just using a solder iron, just connect the middle pad to the 5 volts, then this cam plus minus pads down here will provide 5 volts. If you short the middle pad with the 12 volts pad, these will provide 12 volts. So that way you can set the uh, necessary voltage for your equipment right here on the PDP, which is really nice. You can do this for the cam, for the video transmitter and for the OSD in just the same way which I explained to you. What I really like about this PDP is of course the large solder pads here and the layout of them. I will uh, show this to you in a minute. I also really like that it already comes with a, a filter, a power filter. So that means that you will have a clean power signal which goes to your camera and video transmitter. So you won't have any distortions with that. So this is another point which I really, really like about this. So let's take a look at the weight of this. So for the weight, as you can see, this comes in at about 8 grams, which is not too bad for all the features it provides and for the high amperage which it works with. And then for the size, it comes with the regular sized mounting holes. 
so I will show it to you with the little guy here. And so even for this uh, uh, plate assault, which is a 130 size frame, this will mount nicely here in between with the regular size mounting holes. Of course, I have it probably the other way around because I will uh, have the power leads from the LiPo from behind. So I put it in here like that. So that is your regular size PDP here, which can even be used with this really small micro 130 size frames. I will of course link the complete manual in the description so you can take a direct look at the specific features which you might be interested in for this little PDP. So something else I wanted to show you is of course the, the uh, what I call the good uh, layout for the solar pad. Pads, I will put this again here. So if we mount this in like that, you remember on this side you have the plus pad and the minus pad. You can achieve a very clean setup if you have your ESCs here. You will have the plus wire go here and here. The same for this. Uh, ESC here and here so this is a very short way for these wires so uh, and will uh, allow for a very clean setup and of course as you can see here you can, will of course have to use standoffs here you can't have the PDP connect the carbon because carbon is conductive and with the standoffs you can have maybe the PDP uh, on the bottom and then on top of it the the, uh, the, the flight controller and this will uh, still work fine. So this looks like a very nice PDP. I told you about the things which I really like about this. You can buy it uh, directly from Demoncore, demonrc.au. I will link to this in the description. Take a look. I really like this. It looks nice. If you liked this as well, or if you liked my video, please leave a thumbs up, please subscribe, and I'm really looking forward to see you next time.